fait par la République fédérative tchèque et slovaque. Well, there is the European champion. Upset a lot of folks. Peter Barner of Czechoslovakia. He's dominated in Czechoslovakia, but came out and won the Europeans this year. Peter Barner, and he is a medal possibility. Strong one. Now watch for this combination coming up. It'll be a triple Lutz, triple toe. Very important. Excellent. His triple jump, the triple loop off of a back edge. Again, great. As you watch Peter Barn of Czechoslovakia in the 1991 Worlds, he's the only male skater in the original program to get a perfect six from a judge. The skating being very artistic and classical with the step sequence coming down the ice in a straight line. Watch the change of position from the camel spin to the sit spin, and then up again to another camel spin. Back to a sit spin, and complete. six before. Appreciative crowds and why not? Peter Bonner turned in quite a performance. 25 years old, lives in Prague. This will be one of the top skaters of the evening. Happy with his performance and he should be. Look at how clean the landing is on this jump. No problem with that. And he'll step back up into a triple toe loop. Michael Slipchuk, Canada. Canada. And a nice triple loop here off of a back edge. Very difficult. Again, very nice landing. No doubt about it. Peter Barra has to be quite happy. And we'll give you a little personal aside about Peter while we wait for the scores. His wife, Andre is a former Czech ice dancer and they are expecting their first child in March of this year. The Olympics in February, their first child in March. That's quite a combination and a good smile from a man who will be very much in contention. Obviously, he's only the fifth skater on the ice tonight, but he'll be number one after this first five. And one of the points I want to make is the combination jump that he did tonight, the triple Lutz, triple toe, is not the most difficult combination. But what we're looking for is who does the combination without the mistake. You will see triple axle, triple toe loops, which are harder. However, he has completed this jump and done it well. It'll be interesting to see how the judges score at this point. And as of this moment, Peter looks in to see, and we look along with you to see. Technical first of all. The leader at this moment is Filipowski of Poland. 
But it's a sense that Peter will take over that spot and it may be hard to challenge him as the evening wears on. And a lot of the story will be told with this first mark, the technical mark, where the jumping comes in. His artistic skating and his presentation will come in under the artistic pre presentation, which is second. These times you've been there, Peter, with your sister Kitty, it can be excruciating waiting for them to come up, but finally they're going to come up and they will see, be excellent. Take a look at these. 5'8 from Canada. 5'5 from Finland. That's the highest and that's the lowest. Now, how well do they see that he executed all of this? There's the 5'7 from his Italy. And I think that when we get the artistic impression, these will actually come up once we get the artistic up because his style was so good. And they are. Watch this. We can see them. Here they come. No sixes this time, but he got a 5-9 from Italy and a 5-9 from Austria. And we could see how great his skating was in the artistic side, how classical.